Welcome to Casework Quick Vids for Casework Connector. In this quick vid, we will examine the differences between linkages based on UDF or user defined function protocols and linkages based on DDE or dynamic data exchange protocols. Then we will demonstrate how to convert existing DDE links to UDF links and also how to work with UDF linkages. Starting with the 2009 version, Connector began making use of the user-defined function capabilities within Microsoft Excel. DDE linkages will continue to work in both Excel and Word documents. Using UDF linkages provides several advantages. First, formulas now have a character limit of just over 32,000 characters. This far exceeds the DDE formula character length limit of 255 characters. Second, as long as the Excel document resides within the Working Papers client folder, the UDF linkages will always associate with that client file. This means that multiple instances of Working Papers and client files can be opened without compromising the stability of connector linkages. Also, Working Papers no longer needs to be open at all for linkages to work. DDE, on the other hand, only works with the open client file. Note that if the Excel document does not reside within the client folder, then the UDF linkages can work like DDE links in that the UDF linkages will only work with the open client file. Lastly, UDF linkage formulas can incorporate Excel cell numbers. By default, UDF is enabled as the default protocol. Connector links in Excel documents created prior to the 2009 version would be based on DDE protocols. It is recommended that only one protocol be used by the documents. So if you wish to continue using DDE, you can disable the UDF protocols by selecting Tools, Options, and then uncheck Use Connector User Defined Functions. Converting DDE links is a simple process. Let's open document 2.2, which contains DDE linkages in two separate worksheets. Notice that the calculations all start with CWIN32. To convert your Excel document, simply select the Tools menu and choose Convert Connector UDFs. And notice, as I go back to the other worksheet, this converts the entire workbook. You also have the option of converting more than one Excel document by selecting Tools and choosing multiple convert to connect the UDFs. This will convert all Excel documents found in the selected folder and all subfolders. Creating UDF links with an Excel document is the same as creating DDE links. We simply launch the Caseway Linkage dialog and click what information you want linked and Connector will automatically create the calculation. We know we are creating UDF linkages from the UDF displayed in the top right of the dialog. That concludes our introduction to user-defined functions. Thank you for watching this Caseway QuickVid.